Hi everyone, welcome back to Stalker Shadow of Pripyat. Uh, Alright, so uh, we're gonna go into settings. I'm gonna block that place out because you don't need to see that because you don't um, that's a fucking that that menu is giving you locations which you don't need to know. Um, I've decided that these blowouts and shit are a little bit too frequent because I keep I keep getting stuck indoors and I can see why because it goes 12 to 24, 6 to 12. Just yeah, so let's make these a little bit less frequent. Um, maybe like every other day or something, and then blowouts can be normal. Because blowouts are blowouts are a part of the core game. Fallouts are definitely not. This is a part of the atmosphere mod that I added in. Uh, and then size storms, I forget if which one they are. Um, so, I mean, yeah, we'll just do that. Settings will be stored with the next save game. Ta-da, they're saved. Alright. Is there some reason why everything's blurry? Why is this all blurry all of a sudden? What the fuck? Did I ruin my game somehow? When did this shit become so blurry? Is this the depth of field? Holy fucking shit. The depth of field just went insane. <laughs> what the fuck? Alright, let's uh, eat some health packs and stuff and... Yo, what the hell did I do to my, my game, man? Alright guys, sorry. Um, now you're wondering why it's foggy right now. I think this is actually what it was originally supposed to be. It just was buggy that, as fuck. I don't think it was actually supposed to be a nice day outside. I think I, when I loaded my game it bugged out. That's why the depth of field was all fucky. Because that's the depth of field you're supposed to have when you're, um... Uh, when you're, like, it's fog or something. I don't know, but it's it's fine what? now, so I'm not gonna change anything. It's fucking weird, man. Alright, let's go, let's go actually buy a gun. So we have the... Where's the Mosin Nugget? Or the fuck it's called. That's, that's what everyone was memeing about in the in comments. I'm gonna actually buy one of these guns. I'm buying this one. I don't give a fuck. Alright, let's buy that one and let's buy all the ammo for it. Yeah, this is gonna... this, this is like all my fucking money. Okay, which was the... which is the better ammo for me to take? There is a um... soft jacketed designed for hunting purposes. Maximize stopping power, or the, that's that's body armor penetration. All right, there we go. Okay, now we're poor. Excellent. This this is what I've always wanted. What the fuck is this thing? Why do I have this guy? So we're gonna take the sniper rifle on that guy. Holy shit! Look at this fucking guy. Holy fuck! I should have so probably had this last mission, but whatever. Well, well, sorry. When I say missions, you know what I'm referring to, dude. Am I even gonna? I'm not gonna use this. So I just decided we're selling that. I have just decided this now. What kind of attachments can I have for this? Absolutely none. Alright. So, we're good. And so, with that, go bring the gun over here. Holy shit, the fucking uh. running animation. Here's another bottle. Here's to a good day's work. I just, you know what? I, I installed this nice mod to have like weapons like this, and then I just, I'm being cheap and not using one. Alright, let's see, what kind of- I can't upgrade this? Wow, I just- Okay. Whatever, fine. Let's just have fun. Hey, stalker. How are you? We don't carry weapons around on the ship. Do me a favor, right. put yours away. Um, I'm being shut up. Fuck, can I like go outside? <laughs> oh my god, the keys. And now I'm, now I'm fucking dead. Oh, I didn't take long. I did save it right before I did all that. All of a sudden, it's this fucking uh, weather anomalies that keeps making those things. Whoops. Well, good luck to you. All right. Well, let's head outside. Oh, look! It's not foggy as much anymore. Whatever. 
As long as the depth of field is fine, then I'm good with it. Just run away from this place. Alright, I want to shoot something. Oh my god, look at the fucking range on the zoom. Holy shit. I can, like... Okay, that's pretty cool, actually. But I can't upgrade this, it's the problem, but whatever. We'll just, we'll just put up with it, it's good. Alright, let's, um... Let's have a look at what place we want to go to. Maybe this anomaly right here? Oh, there's, there's, okay, there's a lot of anomalies, I shouldn't say that. We got the fueling station. I think there really was something over there. Oh, old barge is somewhere we want to go as well. Maybe we'll go to the old barge first, and then go to the, uh, fueling station. Then up to some of the other places that we want to go to. Let's bring our other weapon with us instead, right now. Uh, I have like, I have a gazillion scopes actually. Get all these fucking assholes. Down boy! Oh you- Nobody bites Mike Lott and lives. Alright, let's see, where's the old barge at? Alright, this is this sh this shitty ship here. I'm being shot up by something. Uh, he's got a detector and some other shit here. Vodka. Okay, that's all good. I find this is okay. By the way, it's totally the anomalies doing all this. I I should mention that. So that's why we just toned them down a bit at the beginning of the episode, as you saw. So. Because I'm getting kind of tired of it, because I'm constantly stuck inside the ship because of some stupid-ass anomaly. And this is- it's actually really not a fun way of playing. You know? I wish I also had the ACOG for this guy. But I put it away. Because now that I have a sniper rifle, I don't really need a full-on scope. I only got the full-on scope because I thought I was, uh... I thought I wasn't going to use it. Uh, anyways, um, I'm gonna go to the old barge first, because I recognize the place, and I think there's a guy there that we want to talk to. Yeah, here we go. Go open the door. Yeah, this guy's a uh, bit on the crazy side. Who are you? Just a stalker. Are uh, you looking for refuge in the Ark? Make you feel, feel, make yourself feel at home. Uh, where did you get this dog? Uh, that's Lassie, sweet little bitch. <laughs> if not for her, I would have been devoured a long time ago. Curse of mutants, I hate them. Uh, soon, as soon as you close your eyes, they start reaching for you with their nasty claws. Okay, why do you live here? It's an ark. Uh, remember that, you will. If you want to live. When a wave starts, stay close. You have the chance to survive. No mutant will ever break in here. Uh, you mentioned a wave. Yeah, a wave of mutants that will crush and drive people away from the zone. Uh, whatever poor bastards, uh, survive will be swept away. It, by a ginormous emission. It will decimate everything in the zone, except those who are prepared. Now you know anything about crashed helicopters? I know something about one of them. Now it's on a plateau in an area around us crawling with snorks. I go shooting at them every couple days. Why are you looking at me like that? The, it, their whole lair can't be taken out in one go. Okay, how do I get to the plateau? Um, you want to gun, gun down some snorks too? Pro uh, I can lead you there perhaps. Alright, let's go. So, this guy actually takes me to the plateau where one of the crashed helicopters is. Sort of. It's kind of weird. Because, okay, the, one of the helicopters is on a plateau. I didn't actually show you that, but I'll show you later. Watch carefully and follow me. I think you'd be guided there if you had asked someone, how do you get to the plateau? And so now he just fucking went into that. It's really fucking weird how you get there. As I said, I, re I recognize this because I know this guy kind of helps you out here. But I think there's something in that... this place here. As you can tell, it's a very, uh, very nice sounding place. I mean, I could just follow him, but I, I don't know if there's something here. I forget if there was. I'm actually dying. Let me use one of the health packs. 
Yeah, I think we're done with this place. Fuck this place. I think this is a... Uh, no, there's nothing here. Doot, 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 doot. Teleport. Okay, we did it. We got to the fuck though. Feel free to drop by sometime. So we just made it to the plateau, uh, and the helicopter's like right there. So you can see that this is a little bit on the impassable side, but there is a anomaly over here that we can actually have a good look at in a minute. And my health is a bit low, but how many health kits do I have? I have a lot of health kits. Let me just go eat a health kit just for fun. Just delicious health kits. As I said, someone's complaining I wasn't using enough of them. I'm like, fuck, man. I just, I, I don't know. I don't care. Uh, that's good, this guy. Alright, let's have a look at the helicopter over here. Information on the onboard computer. Okay. So Stingray 3 had engine failure in both engines. Hmm. What else is there? A map with what look like possible evacuation locations. Positions B2. Uh, hey. <laughs> it saved. I wonder what happened. Okay, they, uh, there's positions I have on my, um, as an objective. Oh, what the fuck? What a wonderful save. I still think I could salvage it. You know, I wish I had that shotgun actually. Oh. Okay, we salvaged the save. Okay, I looted him. What did I get out of this? I get his fucking leg. That's, that's kind of lame that it would just attack me right here, but it's fine. Alright, um... Okay, so, long story short, uh, we have some... It places to investigate B, B28. Uh, this is all happens to be in Jupiter Station, which is the next area. Uh, or actually, no, it's not there. So, it's just, it's some evacuation location, so... We were already over here, though. But, I guess we'll be back there soon, or whatever. Why is one of the locations there? I don't know, I don't fucking know. Alright, but anyways, yeah, we got it. So we were already at Waste Processing Station. Scar Anomaly, oh. Fuck, I'm joking. Okay, we got another one. I wanna get attacked during a cutscene again. Basically, we got a couple places we can head out, off to, so... Just letting you guys know that. Um, so they did kind of land and there was like an evacuation location just because the engines failed they were able they will they were able to bring it down apparently i think that's how it goes oh oh okay what, what are we what are we in right now this is the kind of thing i i i the kind of vision i get when i'm seeing something i really shouldn't be Okay, I'm a little bit skeptical about going in here. Because this is usually the stuff that fucks with your brain. Alright, so we can see actually on our map here that there are some anomalies, but this is actually hurting me, so... I don't think we- I don't think it's a good idea to do that. We need an EVA suit before we do that, actually. So this is one we're gonna actually skip. It hurts a lot, to be honest, to be near there. So we're gonna skip that one. Um, we have a circus anomaly. Uh, we've already been to the plateau. We have substation workshops. Uh, maybe the workshops could be somewhere, and we also have that fueling station. All right, let's go to the um, let's go to the substation workshops first. Just kind of see what's there. And uh, these guys are stalkers, so we don't have to care.
right. Uh, well, I have a question for you. Let's see. Have you seen any military rounds? Uh, there are five or so jarheads that were spotted coming out of the drainage shuttle by the swamp. Okay. Well, whatever. We don't need anything. We don't particularly want to sell him anything. He can have the boot, though. Because I don't give a fuck about the boot. Howdy ho. I think this is the, uh... Okay, this is the sub the substation workshop where the hell this is. We'll have a good look around here. Uh, you're not welcome here. This is our camp. Uh, you have no business piling around it. My boards are starved and high strung as it is. I can give you some food. All right, you can do that. Canned meat, sausage, and bread, six of each. Be sure to go around because we're hungry as shit. Okay, so canned meat I don't have a whole lot of. Here's the food. Wow, I lost all hope. I just gave him six sausage. Okay, see next time. Well, how much food do I have left? I have a lot of food, actually. I have some bread right now. So now we just kind of got ourselves in here by just by giving them food. Which means we can kind of poke around. So this is the leader. Uh, okay, I guess there's nothing I really want from this guy. So we can, like, that's worth it, because we get food all the time anyway, so... You know, we just want to have a look around and see if there's uh, any goodies. I'm pretty sure there is a goodies, because this is a workshop after all. I'm pretty sure they don't like it if I bring out guns, though. These guys are, I think, military? I don't feel like beating gum. Talk to the commander. Oh, we just got a... Uh, what's this guy? Tools for fine work. Excellent. That's that's that sounds pretty good. And we got a bunch of field dressings and shit like there. Okay, that was definitely worth it. I knew there was something worth it in this place. Fine tools is definitely pretty good. Uh, can we go over here? Why can't we go past this? Ah, here we go. I can just jump it. I don't see anything really over here. Oh, dude, this guy's over here. What the fuck? How did you get over here? I need to initiate a crouch jump. Nah, I'm joking. That really isn't a thing in this game, actually. Alright, so we got fine tools at, at, at the cost of six sausages. That's pretty good. I actually didn't look that one up. I was... I was, uh... I, I was thinking of actually looking it up soon, because I'm like, oh, you know what? We want to have the tools, right? Because we're giant tools here. Um... That's it for that, I guess. I, I mean, I, I got that. I'm glad I stumbled into that. I knew there was something there. Maybe I just remembered it from the last time I played. It was a while ago. So we're going to go back to the fueling station because there was actually apparently something that was there. Um, you can hop onto something here. Yeah, maybe this is not the right weapon for this. I need to get that hunting shotgun. Oh, so just another stalker. Hey. The boss is over there. Go talk to him. The boss is over in the fucking building. That's where he is. Hey, bro. Alright, well, what do you have? Just absolutely nothing. Alright. I'm listening. So there is a way for me to get on top of these things, and there's, like, supposed to be something here. Um... It's a little bit weird how we do it. But there is actually something here. I knew there was something here. So this may take me just a second. Because I'd, I'd prefer to kind of figure it out. I think I was trying to do it before and I was I, I think I almost had it. Okay, let's not go into that. Because if I... That thing is radioactive as shit. So I was trying to go on the fence but the last time. I think it's supposed to be some kind of barrel I can jump on top of. We'll have a look. Fuck me. I am kind of like mostly familiar with most of the stuff in this game, but it I am playing this okay. I should I should just go and mention I'm I've never played this mod before, and that was part of the fun, was that like I just was gonna fuck around and like, mess around with this mod and see what kind of shit there is in it. Yeah, maybe we'll just try and go all the way over here. Oh, fuck. 
Maybe we can jump to it from here. No, not that easy. Try one more time. Maybe from up here. Oh, yeah, we made it. Okay. I, I don't know if that was the intended solution, and I'm going to go out on a limb and say it probably wasn't. But we can kind of see what's up here. Alright, so this roof does not have anything. It has to be on the top of this one. And so I think it's uh, up here? No? I'm trying to think of what else we could do. Without cheating and going ahead, unless I'm fucking blind and there is something around here. I just remember this being an adventure in itself to get up to this place. So it's not that way. Dude, this looks like I should totally be able to just, you know, crawl up here, but I can't. Uh... Yeah, fuck it, one sec. Alright, I, I think I was right under my- oh, that's it. That's it right there. That item. Sunrise bodysuit. I knew there was something here, and that's it actually. So it was kind of in a weird place, but we have it now. So sunrise bodysuit right there. Um, now unfortunately, if I put it on right now, I need to upgrade it first. Because if I put it on right now, I will be in tough shit right now. Uh, no, it's it's uh, it's not giving me more weight capacity, so we're gonna hold off on it now. But I knew there was something here. I knew. I knew. But yes, I did have to look it up for where the fucking actual item was. I knew there was something there. And there's an oak pine anomaly. Let's go go there. I don't even know why I have to convince you of anything. I feel that I do. That's pretty cool shit. Like, it's just, I don't know. It's been like a, like at least three years or something since I played this game. You think it's like riding a bike, but it truly is not. Alright, we have some anomaly things up here. So... Go climb a tree, obviously. Oh shit, I was just about to jump and then like I awkwardly kind of came off of it. I don't think it's at the bottom, I think, I'm pretty sure it's up here. Uh, let's have a look here. Okay, we got one here. Okay, we got one. There's two more. Okay, those are probably below me, actually. So let's try not falling off this thing. Because it doesn't seem like it would be very nice for my health right now. Oh, shit. Such is life in the zone. I'm wearing a nice fucking jacket, though. I have to tell you that. Okay, I got it now. I'm going to just go a little bit more this way. Yeah, they must be below me, because they're moving around. So we're going to fight, figure out a way down. I have, like, this symbol there in my bottom HUD there that says, like, I think my body armor is a little bit wounded or some shit. So what's this, what's this thing do? Let's have a look. Health restoration radiation, alright. Then I really won't need have med, have med kits. <laughs> alright. Let's try this. Alright. So let's uh, try and get the things in the middle here with uh, fucking these things. Ow. Yeah, I'm fucking losing health though. Get the fuck out. Fuck this place. Yeah, this shit hurts, man. Uh, missing stalkers meet grouse. What the fuck? Where's Grouse at? Okay, he wants me to come back there, but he can go fuck himself, because we're gonna go to the crash light first. No more anomalies, because apparently anomalies hurt my ass. We haven't gotten to use a sniper rifle a whole lot. Because, you know, but like I usually don't want to kill things at long range, uh, ironically. Uh, but actually, we may come into a situation where we actually want to do that. Where's my energy drink? There we go. Can we make it up here? Fucking hell. Yeah, apparently I should have chosen a better path. Like, up here! 
for example. Alright. So we have a place with, um... A crashed helicopter right there. As you can see, as I'm extremely zooming in because of this rifle. And we have a poltergeist. So you can see it's lifting up objects and just trying to fucking fuck my day. That's not the poltergeist. Did I kill it? I don't think I did. But regardless, we will pretend like we did. That makes me feel better. Oh, I wonder. I'm wondering if I if I missed some kind of uh, storage beside the helicopter or the other one. I think I got so distracted by the things that were killing me that uh, I may not have looted the area. It just occurred to me. What's this gun? This would be an AK-74. Alright. I don't want any of that shit. Oh, here we go. We got some loot here. Okay, nothing here. Fuck. I wasn't actually crouched. What's this guy? Oh, that's something new. A AEK uh, 973. Interesting. Let me uh, compare that with this rifle. Um, oh, it's got some pretty decent damage and shit, so it's kind of cool. We actually got something new for a change. That's actually... Uh, huh. The way he fucking brings out the, the, the extra magazine, it's like... Holy shit. Someone had fun animating that one. Yeah, I don't think any of these boxes actually have anything. I'm starting to have my doubts. Alright, let's uh, investigate the helicopter. Looks like the crew died in midair and the helicopter simply crashed because there was nobody there to fly it. The onboard computer was a little luckier. I wonder if there's anything useful here. Ah, there's something. A map of the area, with certain locations marked. That should come in handy. Alright, we got, uh, some maps, so... Probably... I think I know someone who might be interested in maps, so... Anyways, we're gonna cut off here, so... See you guys next time. Goodbye.